Welcome back, everybody. The start of 2020 will finally bring a big fight to the Alamo City. Tuesday afternoon, it was announced that Golden Boy Promotions would host a fight in the Alamo Dome that will be featured live on DAZN. It's been a long time coming, but San Antonio will be thrown into the spotlight again for a high profile fight. It's exciting. We have a lot of long history here in San Antonio, especially Oscar. You know, he fought here and, uh, you know, I mean, Texas in general, uh, they're big boxing fans, but San Antonio is a little more special. Uh, they really appreciate good fights. No, this is going to be a very good fight. It's a real fight. I mean, Jaime is developing into a huge star. He's already a big star in Mexico, um, probably second only to Canelo Alvarez. Uh, but, you know, he's been he's been in some really good fights uh, this year, and uh, he's January 11th won't be any different. Jaime Munguia is 34-0 with 27 knockouts and is the WBO World Super Welterweight Champion. The Super Welterweight from Tijuana is moving up to middleweight and is looking to become a bigger name in the United States. Four of his six fights in the U.S. have resulted in wins by knockout. Good. I feel happy to be fighting here in San Antonio, Texas. I also feel content because I'm going to be fighting in this new division at 160 pounds. I'm making a great pre preparation or preparing well in order to deliver a great fight for all the fans here in San Antonio, Texas. His opponent, the veterans Irishman Gary O'Sullivan, a man with a legendary mustache. He's 12 years older than the undefeated Mexican boxer, but he does have three losses, the most notable against Canada's David Lemieux last year. O'Sullivan is on a two-fight winning streak and is thrilled to be headlining a major fight once again. It's no exaggeration when I say it's a dream come true, you know, to fight um, an undefeated Mexican world champion, fighting a Mexican champion in a venue like this is um, something I used to watch on the TV growing up, uh, to be in a position to fight in an uh, event of this magnitude is uh, a dream come true for me. He's undefeated, he's champion of the world, he's ranked number one, it doesn't get any bigger than that, you know, so um, what more, if you couldn't get motivated for that, what could you get motivated for? You know, so um, I'm very, very excited. And, like, you know, work really hard so I can put on a great performance. Whatever you do, don't hit the stash. Before we met the fighters for the main event, Golden Boy announced that San Antonio's Joshua Franco will be fighting on the undercard. Franco just finished a trilogy against Oscar Negrete back in August. The WBA International Bantamweight and NABF Bantamweight title holder has never fought here in San Antonio in his 18 professional fights. Joining Franco will be Holmes High School graduate Hector Tanahata. El Fanito is 18-0 and is the WBC US NBC lightweight title champ. He's also never fought here in San Antonio as a pro, so you know both fighters would love to pack the Alamo Dome for their fights. Neither fighter has an opponent named yet. So Mexico versus Ireland. It's happening in the Dome in just over a month. That's your main event, and you can get tickets through the Alamo Dome box office and Ticketmaster.com. That's it for Inside the Ring. When we come back, Greg will wrap up the show with the results of tonight's web poll question.